Hi, everybody. It's Miss Mary from Skokie Public Library with another Rise and Shine story time. And I'm so glad to be back with you all today to be able to read a book. And just want to remind you, as you know, we have something special at Rise and Shine story time that a lot of other story times don't have. Do you remember what that is? Well, I'm going to show you right here. It is our red magic box. Here it is. And in this magic box is something secret. And we're going to find out what it is and read about it and talk about it today. What do you think might be in here? What would you like to be in here? I think I would like a birthday cake, maybe, because I love birthday cake. It's not my birthday, though. Or a, a kitten, maybe? That'd be kind of fun. Maybe a teddy bear? Oh, it's not actually making a lot of noise. So it's probably not anything hard. Shall we look and see? Want to see what's in here? Okay. Let's see. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's our old friend, Pete the Cat. Now you may know Pete the Cat. There's an awful lot of books about Pete. And I am very fond of Pete the Cat because Pete has this wonderful outlook on life. You know, whatever happens to Pete, expected or not expected, good or bad, he can always find the happiness in it. And that's a great quality to have, right, Pete? Yeah. You know, sometimes um, when something happens to me that I'm not expecting or didn't plan for, I can get a little grumpy about it or maybe feel a little sad about it. But Pete's not like that. Pete always finds the fun in everything. And I think that's a great way to be. So thank you, Pete. And let's read a story about how Pete does this wonderful thing that he does. This is called Pete the Cat, I Love My White Shoes. And it was um, written by Eric Litwin. And the art was done by James Dean, who created Pete the Cat. And this book was copyrighted by HarperCollins in 2008. Now, before we read it, I'd like you to help me a little bit. There are two things in this book that I would like us all to say together. And let me show you what the first one is. You see these words here? Oh, no. Oh, no. And when we come to those words in the story, I'd like us all to say those together. Should we practice now? Let's say, to, say it together. Oh, no. People usually say, oh, no, when something that they think is bad has happened. For instance, um, oh, no, my ice cream fell on the floor. Oh, no, I stubbed my toe. Something like that. But sometimes the things that you think might be bad or not what you expected can turn out to be really fun. It's all in how you look at it. And the other thing that I would like us to say together are these words. Goodness, no. So let's practice that too. Goodness, no. So we'll say, oh, no together, and we'll say, goodness, no, together. And we will read Pete the Cat together. There he is. Pete the Cat was walking down the street in his brand new white shoes. Pete loved his white shoes so much, he sang this song. 
see what Pete's singing. <laughs> Here he is. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. He must really love those shoes. Here's our first oh no, right here. See it? Let's say it together. Oh no, Pete stepped in a large pile of strawberries. What color did it turn his shoes? You think you know? Strawberries are red, right? So probably the strawberries turned Pete's white shoes red. Shall we see? Yes, we're right. Red. Did Pete cry? And here's our next thing we're going to say together. Goodness, no. Let's say that together. Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song. Everything's cool. But he changed the song a little bit now, right? I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. Let's see what's going to happen next now. Here's another oh no. Oh no. Let's say it together. Oh no. Pete stepped in a large pile of blueberries. What color did it turn his shoes? What do you think? Let's see. Blue. Did Pete cry? Here's our goodness no. Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. Awesome. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. Here's our oh no again. Let's say it together. Oh no. Pete stepped in a large puddle of mud. What color? Did it turn his shoes? Do you think you know? Let's find out. Brown! Did Pete cry? And let's say together, goodness no! He just kept walking along and singing his song. Groovy! I love my Brown shoes, I love my brown shoes, I love my brown shoes. Here's our oh no again. Oh no! Pete stepped in a bucket of water. And all the brown, and all the blue, and all the red were washed away. What color were Pete's shoes again? You think you know? White, but they were wet. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along and singing his song I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. The moral of this story is no matter what you step in, keep walking along and singing your song. Because it's all Good. Thank you, Pete the Cat. I'm going to try to be a little bit more like you and see all the happy things that happen to me. And speaking of happy, 
since we're visiting today with a very happy cat, let's sing If You're Happy and You Know It before we go. And it goes like this. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. And let's clap. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Now, we'll stomp our feet, okay? If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. Stomp, stomp. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! And now comes the tricky part. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray! If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, do all three. Clap, clap, stomp, stomp, hooray! Well, I will see you soon again and we'll do more stories together. And in the meantime, I'm going to look for a little more happy. And I'm sure that I can find it just like Pete the cat. <laughs>